All right, I'm here with Christian Mustad from Nautilus Reels. Hey guys. And Nautilus has introduced a really lightweight version of the popular featherweight series called the Featherweight X, the FWX this year. Christian's going to tell us how he designed it. So here's the story, what we did, we took our old featherweight and uh, redesigned the whole spool design to make it a little lighter, uh, help the drag backing dry a little faster, and uh, to get a little larger arbor out of it. We changed the spool release on it, it's the same latch as we used to have, but now it's just to pop right on. And we have nine grooves on the one-way clutch that uh, help you latch the spool on better and it gives you better grip. And there's once you set the drag, there's no slack on it. It's it, instant engagement on the drag, so there's wow. no play. There's no back play at all? None at all. Wow. And so internally, the, the FWX drag is the same as the other one, the SCF, sealed carbon fiber drag. No startup inertia, I mean, it's less than 1%. And the coolest little gimmick we've done this year, we've put on, put on our laser ID tags here. We've lasered on white spots on, to both sides of the reel where you can just sharpie on the line weight that you have on there or the model of line you've got. And you'll always remember what spool's got what line on it. That's pretty much it. I just Same can't cutouts. believe, I'm so impressed with the porting on this. I don't think I've ever seen a real spool that was ported out this intricately with such beautiful thin walls, nice curvature for strength. I mean, this is It's all artistry. done. We do this all on, on software, and soft, the beauty of software these days, you can tell them, hey, I want to take out this much. Where can I take it from without compromising its strengths? And then it sort of tells you where. You do a cutout cut design, and you start applying pressure points on it and it'll show you in color, color schemes where you're getting the most pressure, and then you can reinforce it and take away where you don't have any pressure. Wow, wow. So that's how you optimize your cutouts. That's what we do on the housings, everywhere, the spool shafts, all the components. Wow, so that's the tech behind it. What's the result? How much lighter are these? Than 3 3.8 ounces, almost half an ounce lighter wow. than the old featherweights. They were what, 4.2, I think, right? They were 4.2, four two. this is yeah. 3.8 ounces, and all made in the USA, all made out of aluminum, and, uh, and Nobody comes close. Yeah, especially at the price. Carry tells what this cost. Yeah, that's amazing, man. I mean, this, this should be a $350. You're leaving this money on be. the table, man. These are sweet. I'm starting to think about the price here, <laughs> but it's still $250. Thanks, Tristan. These Good are awesome. Good to see you man. again. Thank you so Thank much. You.